What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Jay. We are here with week four of the UPBA going against Cherry Mancake, aka Cherry, aka one of the young bucks of the Draft League community. Really cool kid, I should say. Not man, but cool kid, because he is a kid. Um, uh, and enjoy your youth. Enjoy your youth 100%. But we're going against him. Oh, uh, this is week four. Hopefully, we can get a double Rooney. Um, we're going to click A and get into it. Um, we did switch our six, so we know he's bringing Sogalio, Garchomp, Sylveon, Gengar. Um, oh, yeah. Sogalio, Garchomp. So, uh, Sylveon, <laughs> uh, Gengar, Sovali, and Rotom. It, the the Sovali, Sogalio, Sylveon. Oh my goodness, that's a tongue twister in itself, if I do say so myself. Um, what I did, uh, this is the same team I actually fought and mocked, interestingly enough, so shout out to Shay. Um, I think I can just lead Chinchino. Chinchino, like, I can U turn out. I can, uh, if Gengar leads, I can knock, if uh, anything. Um, I guess I could I could also lead Coco, but it's not the best if Garchomp does end up leading. So I think I'm okay with going Mink. Um, I just want to say uh, we did schedule this a co like couple of days. I mean yesterday he had he, blah, blah, blah. he didn't have a trouble um, connecting his switch to Land, which is unfortunate because Land is just Land. Land sucks. Gen nine can't get here soon enough with a good timer. I know it will have a good timer. I just know it. I just know it. And so we had to do a couple of things. Ribbons comes out. Fair enough. Um, so right here, um, kind of just want to hit it and see what it is. I'll just hit it. I don't, I don't, I don't know. The switches are kind of bleh. I thought we missed for a second. That's doing a decent chunk. So it doesn't seem like it's fully fizz def or maybe it is three. That's four hits. Oh, so it's not fully fizz def, which is great. Um, let's see what he'll do. Hyper voice. Does that just bop us? Does not. Wonderful. And he's lefties. Okay, so he's not fully fizz def, so he seems more sp def, which is good to know. Um, we can't just tail slap again. If he goes Gengar, then he goes Gengar. Like, you got me. You got me good, kid. You got me good. But he doesn't know that we're Scarf. He does not know that we're Scarf. Okay, so he's going to withdraw. Would you go out into... Micro Rotom. All right, that's fine. We'll take chip on this too. So this is what we need. We do connect, beautiful. So that's two, that's three, that's four, that's five. Yo, that's a two at KO, potentially. So like, this is great because now we have like two things chipped for um, Blaziken, which is amazing. Uh, we do just tail slap again, I think. 100%, this thing could be Scarf. And he might think he outspeeds, but he does not. So we're just gonna we're just gonna hit it again. He could might not think, and we might go for triple axle now. So he's gonna withdraw. Okay, who do you go out into now? Chompers, Lionel. Who's that? Oh, it's the lion, the actual lion. Okay, cool. We'll get some chip on this, which is fine. I still did a chunk. Two, three. Why do I feel like these hits are going faster though? <laughs> As a crit. Oh, um, I felt like those hits were going super fast. I felt like it was sped up. We do see the lefties. Okay, so no weakness policy. Good to know. Very scared of that. Um, I'm hoping this is physical and not calm mind. I pray it is not calm mind. If it's calm mind, uh, good bring, but please don't be. Please do not be. Uh, please don't be. Don't, don't, just don't. So, okay, Woo, it's physical, boys. It's physical. It's physical. It's physical. Thank God. Woo. All right, so we're going to be able to eat this just fine. We're going to save our Chinchino because Chinchino still can put in work, and it did do a phenomenal amount. Um, The question is, does he stay in here? I feel like you don't. I want to teleport, but I also want to Scald. I just don't want the Rotom in for free. Um, Because if he does have to stay in, I could just go out into... I don't think you stay in. I think teleport is fine. Scald is cool because you risk a burn chance. I'm just going to teleport. Ops are toxic me. That's fine. That makes sense. That is unfortunate. We can teleport here. And then I think we just go back out into... I think we go Coco the U-turn. Um, just because uh, this thing is, is a little bit scary. 
Uh, we could force it out because if there's no HP, like Coco actually 2 KOs this thing, which is kind of cracked because Wild Charge does a lot to Solgaleo. Um, I think I even 2 KO if it is max HP, I think. Uh, he's left over, so I don't. But I will U turn. So I could have just scalded right there, but now we're poisoned instead, which is kind of a bummer. So we have, we've seen uh, this thing. With a uh, Toxic and Sunsteel Strike. Uh, probably EQ, maybe. Or you might go for another Sunsteel Strike right here. Does EQ. Okay, so EQ, this. So maybe he has no, um, whatchamacallit. Sucks that I didn't scald the first time, but I really didn't think he would stay in and try to like a risk a burn or anything like that. So I just scald this time. Might get some momentum, but it is what it is. Um, cause well, we, now we just need to know it's last move. Might not even have the dark coverage. Uh, otherwise, uh, I don't know. This will draw this time. Probably goes the Rotom. Yeah. Sucks. That sucks. So we're going to Scald this time. Get a little bit chip on it. Maybe snag a burn. That'd be cool. That's a decent amount. Do we get a burn? Do not get a burn. Unfortunate. And so right here, like, I have to go Tangrowth just because it's very hard to make a read on Bolt Switch versus Leaf Storm because both are very, uh, like, applicable. So I will go into Bulin. Kind of have to. Um, good thing is, like, we have a lot of chip on things. We know that Sogalio is also not, um, wish I'm gonna call it. What's that item? Weakness policy, and we also know it's not, like, Akaberry. So there's a pain split. That's fine. Um, I think right here we can just go for a knockoff. Uh, cause what comes in here? I would assume Sogaleo or, uh, potentially Sovali. Right, there we see the Volt Switch. Gonna do zero. So we gotta see, we gotta see what he'll go on to. I love Tangra, bro. It's a big rubber band ball. That's big rubber band ball. Fallen. Gonna be this. Is that grass? Is that grass or is that bug? We're gonna knock off here. Not gonna do anything. Electricity's gonna disappear as well. Is that bug? I feel like it's bug. Woo! Good bring. Good bring. Um. I mean, multi. I would resist it if he does go for multi attack. And if he goes for U turn, I'll still resist it. So I think we just go into this. I really have a problem doing that. I don't think. Probably we'll see a U turn here if I had to assume anything. That's a good bring. That's a good bring. All right, so multi attack. Okay, we should be able to eat this somewhat decently. Yeah. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Uh, we do just go for a wild charge here and try to get as much damage as possible. So that's cool. Like his whole team is like super duper weak to Blaziken, which is nice. Run a wild charge here. There's a lot. We're gonna take some recoil. I think we die. Toxic. All right. That's fine too. We take those. Take those. Um, uh, Silvali. Bug. 50. Tapu Coco. Dazzling Gleam. We'll kill. So we'll just go for that. Rather than taking more chip. Um, I guess you could. Uh, would you go Rotom? That's a little bleh, right? I don't think you go Rotom. He does opt to switch out, though. Interesting. I could Rotom. He does go Rotom. All right, nice. I cut a U turn, but it is what it is. Oh, uh, we know this thing is not Scarf. And we're getting chipped. Um, I will U-turn here. I think I feel comfortable going Chinchino here. Uh, because if he does try to pain split me again, don't want to allow that. And then if uh, Chinchino actually will get some health back. We're U-turn. Does a buttload. And I'm just gonna, cause if you opt to Volt Switch and he kills me, um, but yeah, see the Volt Switch or Pain Split, one of the two. Definitely one of the two. So we'll see. He might get me. He might not. Does Volt Switch? Fair enough. Fair enough. 
But at least we get momentum out of it. So that's cool. But who do you go out into here? Because, like, Garchomp... I mean, not Garchomp. Blaziken is looking really good right here. If we can get Blaziken in, it is looking super duper good. The only thing is he's keeping the chomp in the back. He's keeping that chomper in the back. All right, so we know that this thing is not fully fizz. Um, we just go Coco. 100% gotta go Coco. And uh, I think I just wild charge. Cause if he goes Garchomp, nothing gained, nothing lost. Uh, we'll just wild charge here. 100% we'll just wild charge here. Those will draw. Who do you go out into? Lionel. Oh, this thing is going to take a lot. It is going to take a lot. It is going to take a lot. Yeah, this is a decent amount. I think we do die to Toxic here. If we don't die to Toxic, I'll U-turn. We don't. All right, nice. So I'll just U-turn out. I'll U-turn out. Get some more chip on this thing. He might Morning Sun. Really just got to get Blaziken in. It's the hardest part, to be honest. Um, And now we can just go Slow King free very freely. He might have Teleport on this. He could. That could be the last move. Um... All right. all right, all right, all right, all right. He does have Morning Sun, so that's the last move. Morning Sun, Earthquake, Sun Steel Strike. All right, and Toxic. So Blaziken actually can set up on this thing very freely, actually. So I might take this opportunity. Uh, the only problem is I just don't have Chip on the Chomp. That's the only problem. So I can't reliably set up yet. Otherwise, if I had chip on chomp, if I had necessary chip on chomp, we'd be in a good spot. Like if I had, if it just takes twenty five percent, then Blaziken can win. But full health chomp is very problematic. He does opt to withdraw. Ribbons comes out, which is not the best case scenario. So it's called right here. Don't burn. All right, cool. Um, I could toxic this thing, which I think I might opt to do. I will opt to do that. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I just gotta get... There's the wish, of course. Just gotta see. Just gotta see, just gotta see. Alright, so there's that. We're gonna Toxic, which is nice. Uh, if I teleport right there, I think we would've been cool. We're doing kind of cool. So at least it's poison now, which is great. Residual is always great. Um, I think I just opted to teleport here myself. Just to at least get some momentum. If he hits me, he hits me. I just have the heal bell. Okay. That's not the best case scenario. It's a scenario, but it's not the best. It's not indeed not the best. So we're going to teleport here. He has heal bell wish. Um, I think we just go out into you. 100% just go out into you and we can sludge bomb. It does have lefties. I kind of want to knock off, actually. Because lefties are very annoying. But we know it's not fizz death, so it's not too much of like a threat. I would say. I think I'm just gonna sludge bomb instead. He's gonna wish, okay. Cause who do you go out into on the wish? You go, you would definitely go like. There's a poison, nice. So, what is this? Wish, heal bell, hyper voice. So he's not, he could be calm mind, but I severely doubt it. Severely, severely, severely doubt it. And I think I just go, I just keep sludge bombing. So if we go to Galeo, that's fine. There's a heal bell, that's fine. Um, I just don't. I don't think it's calm mind. I really don't. We're gonna sludge bomb again. 
Poison? No poison. Because I don't want the Silvali to come in for free. Really don't. And I don't want the Rotom to either. I'm going to knock off this time. Because it might go Solgaleo now. But it doesn't matter because Solgaleo can't really touch my Tangrowth. It doesn't have a move to hit it. If I was Leech Seed. If I was Leech Seed Tangrowth. Oh my goodness. That's a lot. That's quite a bit. We're going to knock off here. So no more lefties, which is great. Um, the question is, do I go... I mean, I kind of have to sack my Coco. I need Tangrowth for Chomp. Absolutely. This Coco is really low. I think I would die upon like entry anyways after like the like coming in and I take poison chip if I'm not mistaken. So this is a, a little toughy, 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 toughy. If I had leech seed, if I had, my tango had some leech seed, but then again, if we didn't have a sulfus, I think right there we would have taken a lot more. But time pass, fair. That's the last move. Okay, good to know. I think I do die, right? Or is it not till the next turn? That would be great. Sharknado. Oh, it's the chomp. It's the chomp. We do die. Unfortunate. All right, so what we can do is we do 100% go out into Tangrowth here. Yeah, we just go tank. Uh, we should be able to tank any fire move if he does have it. Because I just need to get this chip on this thing and then we can win. Uh, so I 100% just go for energy ball. It'd be great. It'd be great if that were the case. If he lets us get this chip, that's very, very big. He does not. Unfortunate, but I had to go for it. Fallen comes out. Ah, oh, that sucks. That does suck a bit. Or an energy ball. Oh, we don't get the KO. We don't get the KO. Um, I think we have to take this hit. Ah, uh, we have to take this hit. I think we have to. Ah, uh, there's a multi attack. Do we live? We do live. Nice. Shout out to Tangrowth. Shout out to Tangrowth. Shout out to Tangrowth. All right, so because now the I feel like the Sylv does come in now. I feel like the Sylv 100% comes in, and we know it's not like fully Fizz Def, because otherwise Chinchino would not to a KO. Dengar comes in. Um, on the off chance that this thing, I think I have to let my Tango down here, and I have to knock off. Because it could be Nasty Plot. But if it's Nasty Plot... I don't really have a switch into it at the moment either. So I, I kind of just have to... I think I have to do this. Yep. Alright, cool. No, sir. Absolutely not. No, sir. Absolutely not. Yeah, Sub Nasty would be the worst case scenario. Absolutely not. So we know it's not Scarf, which is great. Because now Crook will outspeed it. Pretty much outspeed his whole team. And we can go for Knock. Um, So we will Knock here. You're not going to do that to me, Cherry. <laughs> not today. No, sir. Dazzling Gleam. So he does have the Gleam. It should just KO. It would be great if it didn't, but alas, it does. All right, so. Disappears. Earthquake is almost free. We're going to go Crook. And then we have to knock off here. Or do we just darkest? I think we darkest Larry actually. Ooh, if Rotom was dead, we just spam EQ. We're gonna darkest Larry it. No we'll draw. Yeah, it makes sense. Does he go Rotom? Yeah, awesome. So this thing is now dead, which is great. So now next time Crook comes in, we can just spam EQ.
We got the Moxie boost. Doesn't matter too much though. Doesn't matter too much though. Because uh, we cannot kill the Sylveon with where we're at. Um, so we will go Slow King. Um, Crocodile Earthquake to Sylveon. That's less the it's just the spread. The Chinchino was able to KO. There's a Hyper Voice. There's a Chunk. So we just need Blaze. I just need Blaze. Just need Blaze. We're in Toxic. Are we Toxic or do we Teleport? Nickel Toxic. I'm gonna do a wish. But two things are dead. He would only wish on this Toxic Cool. Um, how much is it doing to my Blaziken? Hyper Voice is not, doesn't Oko. Unless he's like max special attack. But I don't think he is. Otherwise, he would have killed my thingy. Um, I think we teleport. All right, cool. That's a good play. So he did the right play. Don't die, which is cool. So we can save Sloking as some fodder. Um, Blaziken, that's plus two. Can just knock this thing out. Because now, if we can chip this thing. Alright, because then Crook can win. Either Crook or Blaziken wins here. A thousand percent. Because we know it's Baton Pass Wish, Toxic, Hyper Voice. So we're going to SD. Do we protect or we SD? I think we just SD. We SD. Oh, okay, never mind. We get a free, a free, free, free. Very free. Okay, nice. So I thought he was going to opt to pop my air balloon. Maybe he missed it. Or maybe he has dragon move. So actually what I'm going to do, because we don't kill this thing, I'm going to try to get the plus four. Garchomp. I'm going to try to get the plus four, because we won't kill it if he's max HP, max defense. Yeah, but we will kill it um, at plus four. Um, I could protect and see what he wants to go for, but nothing should kill me, right? I mean, Outrage could if he's max attack. Do I just try to protect? I'll protect and see what he wants to go for. Let's see what he wants to go for. Toxic. Okay, interesting. Alright. So he's toxic. So he's going to let me just... Swords dance here? I'm just going to swords dance then. Ah, endure. Okay. I see you, big dog. 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 I see you, big dog, on your wolf wolf. I see you, big dog. He was the endure. Now we're going to close combat. So we can just straight up nuke this thing. Can absolutely just nuke this thing. Alistair, is that the Gengar? Good play. Good play, good play. Doesn't affect the ghost. Good thing we're not high jump kick. That would have sucked. Woo. Woo. All right. So now we'll flare blitz 100%. So we're in a pretty good spot. We're going to kill this Gengar, which is nice. All right. So now we just can spam. Oh. Wow. 
that kind of sucks. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, that really kind of sucks. Not gonna lie. Uh, because, I mean, we're plus four. Never mind. We just we can still nuke Sylveon with a CC, so it's fine. So Galio, on the other hand, I don't know if we can nuke that because this is a Galio. Oh, we can, even if it's max HP. So that's cool. That's cool. Unfortunately, we can't just click Flare Blitz, but it's fine. So this thing comes out. Um, we're gonna opt to close combat. Cause he could endure here. Does he endure again? Kind of a toss up, right? Cause he can't EQ me. He has toxic endure. We're gonna close combat. Just gonna nuke the shark. Sharknado is gone. We don't like sharks. I'm just kidding. I love sharks. Shark Week is amazing. I love Shark Week. We're gonna take some rough skin. I think Blazer kind of has it secured at this point. And he was Rocky Helmet. All right, it makes sense. Yo, he was Endure Toxic. Oh boy. I think I think Air Balloon came in clutch. I'm pretty sure he had EQ and stuff and whatnot. So Air Balloon coming in clutch. We still have it, which is kind of um, surprising to be honest. And then even if he comes in here with uh, Sylve. Yeah, he does come in with Sylph. I was about to say, if he comes in with Sylph and it lives, we could just go Crook and EQ, and then I think uh, we would be able to get away with it, I think, maybe. Uh, but we have to go for CC, absolutely. That's our only play, unfortunately. Um, If it doesn't kill, we just go Crook, and then Crook wins. So, just nukes it. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's go. So, Blazy can finally looking like an Uber. Finally, look <laughs> like an Uber. We were able to position it in very well. Um, I'm surprised he gave me... Um, maybe he didn't see the air balloon and that's why he swapped out. I'm very surprised he gave me like a free plus four. Uh, is the cursed body... Are we still cursed? Is it over? Can we go for it? Uh, it's still disabled. Okay. So we'll go for CC. We'll go for CC. And that should be GG. It is absolutely GG. Yo, shout out to Blaziken. Look at Blaziken doing some speed boost SD shenanigans. You'll love to see it. You'll love to see it. GG to Cherry. We finally are able to snag a dub, which is great. Not our first dub, but our second dub. We're now 2-2, two and two, which puts us back up. I mean, we're still in the playoff race, but we're more so in the playoff race now. Um, we do have a hard week five going up against Lux. Mr. Undefeated Lux and his scary offensive team and very thick team also. But finally, we got it up. Make sure to go check Cherry out down below as well. The other awesome UPBA coaches. Um, it was, this was a fun one. It was like uh, more so just because, you know, Blaziken is always fun uh, when it works. Uh, the speed boost sword dance is always so fun. Snowball and you love to be a snowball. Um, but yeah. Um, yeah, if you guys uh, like this video, make sure to leave a like down below. And if you are new and want more of this content, go ahead and subscribe and click that notification bell. So you know when I post without further ado, I'm your boy Jay. I'm going to get about your hair and I'll catch y'all next time. Bye.